Hi, this is Brian. Welcome back to another micro class. This one is on PCT versus RSF. It's inspired by executive toughness by Dr. Jason Self. PCT, RSF, what is that? Problem centric thinking. And we have relentless keyword solution focus. Guess which one is a hallmark of executive toughness, of toughness in general? We want to be relentlessly focused on solutions, move from problem to solution focus, PCT versus RSF. Now, the reality is, is that we actually evolved to have what Daniel Amen calls ants, automatic negative thoughts. Rick Hansen says our brains are like Teflon for positive stuff. And they're like Velcro for negative stuff. Now that wasn't a bad thing millions of years ago as we were evolving and surviving, but problem-centric thinking today is a problem. If we wanna be tough, we've gotta to move from problems to solutions. Imagine if you have this whiteboard, problems on one side, solutions on the other. How's your whiteboard look? Do you have a ton of problems you're constantly obsessing about or are you focused on transitioning these into solutions? Selk tells us that one way to do it is ask yourself the question, what's one thing I can do right now? What's one thing I can do to make the situation just a little bit better? Not perfect, but a little bit better. That's where we get overwhelmed is we think we need to solve our entire problem. He says that's not true. Relentless solution focus is, he says, just plus one it. Plus one, get a little bit better. Incremental improvement over time is huge. But if you think you need to be here this moment, you're gonna be in trouble, you don't. Just take the next step, and then the next step, then the next step. Problem to solution, be relentless about it. He says, make it a game. Give yourself 60 seconds to be in problem mode, and then get into relentless solution focus, RSF. All right, do you have a problem in your life? Identify it. That was a joke, by the way. We all have problems, <laughs> but how do we move to solution and do so rapidly? 60 seconds. Let's be relentless. Let's be tough. Hope you enjoyed. Look forward to sharing more. Have another awesome day. See ya. Isn't it a bit odd that we went from math to science to history, but somehow missed the class on how to live? For some wacky reason, Optimal Living 101 never made the schedule. Of course, it's too late to go back and change that, and you're too busy to read full-time to catch up. Yet, if you're like us, you're all about optimizing your life and actualizing your potential. So, imagine this. Imagine having someone read the best books on optimal living and pulling out the big ideas that can truly change your life. You know, those sections you asterisk and underline and mark all up. Then imagine that guy, me, connecting those ideas to other great books and helping you apply them to your life today. Well, that's what I do with something we call Philosopher's Notes, where I break down each great book into a simple six-page PDF, 20-minute MP3, and 10-minute Philosopher's Notes TV episode. Then imagine me taking the absolute best big ideas from those great books and sharing them with you in fun, inspiring, super practical, optimal living 101 classes. On stuff like Purpose 101, Confidence 101, Business 101, Meditation 101, that sort of thing. You got a personal trainer? I'm kind of like your personal philosopher. Ancient wisdom plus modern science plus common sense plus virtue plus mastery plus fun. That's what our optimized membership program is all about. We'd love to have you join us. Check us out at brianjohnson.me slash join.